Visiting the Palenque. The jungle welcomed them with its symphony of bird songs and the rustling of leaves. Towering mountains, deep gorges, and cascading waterfalls surrounded them, painting a mesmerizing picture of Chiapas' natural beauty. Lele couldn't help but feel a deep sense of awe and wonder as he gazed upon the breathtaking landscape. Their adventure led them to the entrance of the ancient Mayan city of Palenque, where stone steps led the way to a world frozen in time. The temple spires rose like sentinels, their majestic presence telling stories of an era long past. But what truly captured their attention were the toucans that fluttered about, their colorful plumage a vibrant contrast against the ancient stone. In the midst of their exploration, they encountered a captivating and knowledgeable guide, Swainson's toucan. This toucan was no ordinary bird, it was the appointed guide at the temple, a creature of both knowledge and beauty. With its large, striking beak, the toucan immediately caught Lele's attention. Its beak was a sight to behold, with the top and front adorned in a brilliant shade of yellow, radiating like a burst of sunshine against the lush green backdrop of the jungle. The vibrant yellow extended down to its chest, neck, chin, and cheeks, creating a striking contrast to the emerald tapestry of the surrounding foliage. But what truly captivated Lele was the toucan's eye-catching eye ring. It was a shade of green that seemed almost fluorescent, an iridescent halo that framed its eyes like a piece of fine jewelry. It seemed to be the appointed guide of the temple, a creature that embodied both knowledge and beauty. With a friendly chirp, the toucan beckoned them to follow, and they embarked on a journey through time. The toucan shared tales of the Mayan civilization, its rituals, and the inscriptions that adorned the temple walls. Lele listened with wide-eyed wonder, absorbing the history and culture of this mystical place. He knew that this adventure was a precious gift, an opportunity to learn and grow alongside his loving daddy. After their enlightening visit to the temple, Lele and Dada decided to seek refreshment in the arms of nature herself. A short walk through the jungle led them to the mesmerizing Agua Azul waterfalls. The crystal clear blue waters cascaded over terraced limestone steps, inviting them to take a dip. With laughter and joy, they waded into the cool pool at the base of the waterfall. The waters washed away the heat of the day, and they marveled at the natural beauty that surrounded them. Lele felt a profound connection to the jungle, the temple, and the waterfall, as if they were all part of a grand tapestry of life and history. As the day turned into evening, and the jungle was bathed in the warm hues of sunset, Dada and Lele knew that their adventure had not only been about discovering history and nature but also about the special bond they shared. With the sounds of the jungle echoing in the background, they made their way back home, their spirits forever entwined with the mysteries and beauty of Palenque and Chiapas. As they settled into their cozy treehouse under a starry night sky, Lele and Dada knew that each day held the promise of new adventures and discoveries. And so, under the watchful gaze of the jungle's twinkling stars, Lele drifted into a peaceful slumber, his dreams filled with the wonders of Palenque and the loving presence of his dear Dada. For in the heart of the lush and vibrant Chiapas jungle, every day was an adventure, and every night was a dream waiting to unfold.